I believe, check this out boys, Gareth Davis is out and about with his microphone again and he's going to be speaking to the godfather of rock and roll from this town, Noel Gallagher. Yeah, I am with the godfather of rock and roll from this town. We've got boxing legends in here tonight and we have the music legend himself. Noel, you've been here on many occasions because you're a big fight fan, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, oh, well, aren't we all, yeah. Yeah. You've been here for many Ricky Hatton fights. I remember you in Vegas for his fights. Yeah, even. I carried Ricky's belt out in Vegas and been here for a few nights and done shows here with Oasis on myself, yeah. What do you think about Khan and Brooke? You couldn't miss it, presumably, because you followed their careers. Yeah, um, the two relatively local lads, you know what I mean, from up north, and kind of looked at my schedule and was like, I'm going to go out, I'll have a bit of that tonight. And uh, funnily enough, I just checked into an hotel. Kel's staying in the next room next door. So I just I just seen him. He was in bed, actually, relaxing. He looked great, and he was all relaxed and looking happy, and uh, it will be a great night. Has it swung your view on who might win tonight, then? Uh, you can't call it. Can't. Everybody, I've been listening to you on the radio and everybody else saying, we'll only know when it starts. And I think Kel comes out swinging and catches him early, if you like that. But if he doesn't catch him early, he might get frustrated. So we don't know, which is why we're all here. It's so weird, isn't it? When there's so many imponderables, we get older and older and we watch the fathers of guys we watch box become friends. I wonder if these two will ever become friends. I hope so, but you know, it looks it looks real for Kel. Amir doesn't really look to care that much about it, but it depends who wins, and it depends how they win. Exactly. If, if it's a disputed split decision, nobody wants that, but if it's a definitive win, then the other one's got to wear it, and that's the end of it. We were talking to Connor Ben, who's part of our commentary Go team. Tottenham, 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 Tottenham. <laughs> uh, that, that Derek Chisora has just turned up over my shoulder, <laughs> lifted me up. and you. Uh, no. I am I'm upset. I mean, we'll talk about this later. He's my mate, by the way. I, I, I'm glad he is. I'm glad. He, no, we were talking to Conor Ben about how, for Cal, all the things he's wanted that Amir's always achieved, like the, the uh, Olympic stardom as a teenager and, be, you know, being a British Pakistani Muslim, being a superstar, you know, all the things achieved in boxing and as a personality as well, that he... Kel can take his soul tonight, and that's what yeah, yeah, warriors yeah. do with each other. Yeah, well, Kel, well, Kel's been after it for for the best part of his career, and tonight's the night, and it's the moment of truth. And if he does it, fair play to him, because he said he's been going to do it for years, and if he does it, fair play to him. I just hope it's definitive, no matter what. It's great you're here. Thanks for your time, brother. Thank Cheers. you very much. Thanks. Cheers. There he is, Noel Gallagher speaking to Gareth Day Davies, and then they got bombed by uh, Derek Chisora, who wanted to talk about the football results two minutes.